think a lot of my students were really surprised to find out about my background uh, in rhythm and blues, and even more so after I got to the University of Tennessee, Knoxville, in 1988. Uh, by that time, I was even more, uh, had, you know, my reputation as a jazz uh, pianist and composer was even more known. So the R&B thing became, uh, you know, more of a distant memory for me. And so, uh, but you know, a lot of times still, even today, uh, I find it easier to start students out, even though they want to learn to play jazz, I would start them out with some R&B tunes that I feel like uh, if they know the basic triads and so on, uh, then, you know, I would start them out with a tune like Soul Limbo by Booker T and MGs, or I have them playing uh, uh, what's the tune? Uh, Your Precious Love by Marvin Gaye, that, uh, that Marvin Gaye did with Tammy Terrell. And uh, what's some, I was trying to think of some of the easier songs, you know, later stuff like People Make the World Go Round. But songs with a lot of triads, so uh, the Jackson 5, uh, I'll Be There. Uh, uh, the Emotions tunes, uh, Best of My Love, a lot of those songs is real tr triadic and just, you know, real easy for students to pick up on. And and so, it, you know, after a lesson or two, in some cases they might not even know their chords, but the songs are simple enough that after a lesson or two, I can have them playing, um, you know, some great songs and they feel good about themselves, you know, uh, playing Stevie's tune, uh, Living for the City. You know, it's basically triads and so on. Uh, but you know, like I said, that's, that was, I feel like that was my background. Uh, you know, with James Williams and Mulgrew, uh, that background was more gospel. And but in the case of Mulgrew, it was still, you know, James, I know heard the R&B stuff, but I, from talking to him, I don't think he played in this many bands, but with Mulgrew, I said he played in some R&B bands. And so, you know, like I said, even though I heard a lot of gospel, uh, I wasn't playing piano then. And, uh, but, uh, you know, uh, yeah, so that's still more of my background. I kind of think of myself as a rhythm and blues piano player that graduated to playing uh, jazz music.